Hello dear students, hope you are all doing great. In next four days, NEET MDS paper 2023 is going to be in front of us. All the very best. You are all prepared enough. Don't worry at all. Don't take stress. Take a deep breath and start revising. Believe me, these last four days, our brain is ready to grasp whatever we are going to give it. It will work like a robot. It is very active and it works to its fullest potential in this very last moment. We all know that, right? For our theory exams, that last 10 minutes of revision with our best friend will be the best time to revise. In the same way, these last few days are the best time to revise your entire syllabus once again. So how to utilize these last four days to the best? First day, that is today, you do revise the entire synopsis from whatever resources you have prepared till now. Entire synopsis should be revised and brushed up completely. And the next day, you revise your notes. Whatever notes you have prepared till today, you, you revise your notes. In the third day, pictures, uh, there may be radiographic appearances and your uh, pathognomic features, your classifications, drug of choices, all memory based tables, numbers, uh, those all numericals, give one full day to them. Believe me, they are going to change your results. So, the third day revision is your memory based. And the fourth day, do one or two papers. Along with knowing the right answer, do read the explanations for each and every question that you have attempted. That's it. These last four days, this is all we can do. And don't forget to sleep for seven hours a day, at least. Good sleep will give you lots of energy to work more to your best potential. Then, once the paper is in front of you, first thing you all should know is that you should have faith in yourself. You are much bigger than what you actually think. Believe me. So have faith in yourself. Now how to answer the paper? Right from the first question till the last question, just read each and every question in your first go. Answer all those questions in this first go, which you are 100% sure. So answer all those questions which are 100% sure in this first go from first question to last question. Now, few questions in this first journey of reading the questions, few questions will be like your brain will tell you that you have somewhere seen this question, this type of question or the concept is somewhat familiar to you. In the back of your uh, consciousness, the brain will work out on these questions. When you are moving on to the next questions, brain will keep on thinking on those questions also. Now, when you are answering the second time the question paper from question number one, your brain will drive you to answer those questions which you are already familiar with. In the second go, you are going to answer this 70%, 60 to 70% sure questions. Now, there are some questions which are 50-50. Like, you can eliminate two options for sure. Take a risk to your students. When you are surely eliminating two options and you are sure that any one of the remaining two options is correct, answer those questions. There is chance of getting it right. Take a risk and answer them. And there are few questions like clinical scenarios where they want us to give the answer as a treatment plan. So the treatment planning will be there in the different types of treatment planning will be there in your four options. Before you choose a correct option, your mind should first think of diagnosing the problem in the question. When your diagnosis is pretty sure, your treatment planning in the options will also be correct. So first diagnose the problem and then choose your correct option regarding the treatment plans. This is one type. When it comes to the numericals, when it comes to the numericals, choose an option that is related to number 2 and very close to normalcy. The initial cavity depth should be 1.5 to 2 mm, not greater than 5 or 6 mm, right? So, that 1.5 to 2 mm is what like we know somewhat it might be correct. So, go with those normalcy type of numbers. Don't go to extremities. So, the extremities in the options may lead you to the wrong answer go to the median 
mean mode median we have read studied right go to the more likely normalcy type of numerical rather than going to the extremities numericals in option choosing the options and there are few questions where you don't know at all they are some out of box questions and those concepts you have never ever learnt please don't take risk in such questions don't answer such questions which you don't know at all because negative marking will definitely show its power in those questions so stop answering such questions which you don't know at all take risk when you know that two options were completely eliminated and the remaining two either one of it can be correct you can take risk in those questions so do your best and remember dear students the few months of preparation what you have done is not going to change your result the the result will be upon your performance that you are giving in these 3 hours and that performance is based on your entire undergraduate period till today so all these 5 to 6 years of learning and hard work is what is going to decide your performance in your exam and your result it is not that the few months of preparation or last few days of preparation is not going to alter it okay so i hope you all have prepared well enough all the very best believe in yourself no stress only the trust can give you the better results all the very best